Hey team, this is Coach Bruce. Uh, just putting away some of my um, expenses for the Rouse Legacy Group business. Um, wanted to do a quick video to you guys, um, especially to the high schoolers, you women, you young men. Think about um, your plans uh, for the summer. Exactly what do you plan to do this summer that's productive, um, that is rewarding, where you are uh, working on yourself, okay? Um, and staying out of trouble, all right? Let me give you two quick tips, all right? If you're going somewhere, um, party, uh, some concert, some event, somebody's house, whatever it is, and it's three or more people in the car, you are inviting yourself for trouble, okay? The cops love stopping people, especially if they're young adults with three or more people in the car, all right? So be careful. If it's just you and one buddy, you and your girlfriend, something like that, that would be um, advisable. But if it's more than that in the vehicle, you're inviting trouble. So you want to make sure that this summer you are doing something that is productive, all right? Um, you don't want to be doing anything that is non-productive or that's going to get you in trouble, all right? Um, so just think, um, if you fail to plan, you plan to fail, all right? So you want to plan your summer, whereas there's certain things you're going to be doing in the month of June, in the month of July, in the month of August. Um, there's certain books you want to read. There's certain amounts of exercise you want to get. You got to take care of yourself, you know, spiritually, mentally, and physically, okay? You got to take care of yourself spiritually, mentally, physically. Get your prayer time in. Spend time with God. Spend time in the Bible. Spend time perfecting yourself um, and your skill set. Whatever you plan to do in life, you want to make sure that you're working on that this summer. Don't let three months go by. Uh, some of you probably two, two and a half months and you have not done anything to perfect yourself, all right? Now, nobody's going to drag you out to the library. Nobody's going to drag you out to Barnes & Noble Bookstore or force you to buy books off of Amazon. You have to do it yourself, okay? It's going to take self-discipline. You can't blame nobody, can't blame mama, can't blame daddy because you heard it from Coach Bruce that you got to work on yourself, okay? you got to protect your future, all right? You got to understand that freedom is not free. Freedom comes with responsibility, all right? Freedom comes with responsibility. You know what I'm doing? See, these are receipts, all right? Now, I'm free to buy whatever I want, but the responsible thing is i got to come home and take it off of my bank register that I keep to make sure that I know what my balance is because balancing checks, getting up to the register and your card don't work, mm -mm. not going to happen here, okay? And it shouldn't happen there either, all right? So let me wrap it up. If you graduated high school and this is your summer before college, understand that freedom is not free. Once mom and dad turn you loose and you're at college and you're trying to do things for yourself, you know, you are going to have to be a responsible person. You're going to have to understand time management. How much study time do you have? How much social time do you have? How much exercise time? How much spiritual time? You got to work it all in. You can work it all in if you want to work it all in. Okay? Now, if you're in high school and you're going between your junior year and your senior year and it's your last year, guess what? You got to finish strong. All right? Understand this. Here this from Coach Bruce. Finish what you start, okay? Dropping out and quitting is not an option. Finish what you start. Thank you for listening. Have a great summer. Be safe.